Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you what I got for my 17th birthday. So as I'm filming this, it is my 17th birthday. It is Thursday the 5th of November 2020, so I turned 17 today. Um, I'm still in my school uniform as it's 10 past 3 right now and I had school today, it was my first day back after half term but it was I was only in until 11 o'clock I was only in until 11 o'clock because I have mocks all of this week and I'm on study leave for any time that I don't have an exam so I was only in from 9 to 11 because that's when I had an exam so yeah that's why I'm in school, still in my school uniform because I had my exam and then I got to come home at midday so now I'm going to get into what I got for my birthday first things first, I do just want to say as always, this is not me trying to brag, it's not um, me trying to show off what I got or like uh, make anyone jealous or I don't know, some people might think I've got a lot and some people might not, but I'm purely making this video because I enjoy watching these videos and if anyone makes a video like this I absolutely love watching it, I find it really really interesting and it also gives me some ideas of things like I'd like to ask for for Christmas and birthdays, so that's why I'm making this video and if you feel like it's gonna upset you then please just click off um, because that is not my intention at all anyways let's get into what I got so I actually went into my exam at 9 o'clock this morning and hadn't opened any presents um, beforehand at home normally my birthday our family kind of tradition is to open presents in the morning before school and then go to school have a birthday and then come home so the first present I actually opened was my friend at school and she is also my boyfriend's cousin, but we're really, really good friends. And she wrote me a really cute card. And then we also, she she got me, they got me these little earrings from Philip Jones Jewelry. And I will show you it now. They are so, so cute. I was going to put them in, but I wanted to save them to go in this video. Anyway, I had to stop filming for a second there. Sorry about that. Because our washing machine was like making a really strange noise. It's very, very loud. But she got me these earrings here, which are from Philip Jones Jewellery, and they are hoop earrings with cute little daisies in. I'm going to put them in as soon as I finish the video. Let me just show you. So there you go. You can see the little daisies on there. Let me just, just open them up. Look how cute they are. They're like little teeny daisies, and they have, they're all silver, and then they have like a little gold middle. So that was the very first present I opened this morning, so that was a really, really great start. The next present is for my parents, and this is just kind of a jokey present. This was pink fuzzy dice for my car. Um, so because I'm 17, obviously I'm learning to, I'm going to be able to learn to drive after lockdown, fingers crossed. And so these were for when I learned to drive. I'm really sorry about any background noise. I feel like it's so loud, but I'm not sure if the camera's picking it up. But my parents are both downstairs as they're both working, and it's really loud and it's really frustrating but I'm obviously trying to film the best quality video I can so I'm um, yeah I'm sorry about that two other things very random things so I'm doing them first that my parents got me for my car were these I've got a bit of paper on because they were in like a surprise box these microfiber cloths just to clean the car and some magnetic L plates for the car for when I'm learning to drive as I do have my visual license so hopefully we'll go out for a drive tonight, fingers crossed, if we're allowed, I'm not sure, because of lockdown. So on to some more exciting presents now. Yesterday, just before lockdown started, um, I popped to my friend Ellie's and I went to see her and she got me a really, really lovely present. So let me show you. So she got me this like gift box here and I'll show you a couple of things in it. So she got me this fantasy hair and body glitter. Very cool. That'll be great for hopefully when we can go out again, like festivals and things. She got me this really, really cute bracelet by Lady Maid and it says feathers appear when angels are near those we love don't go far away they walk beside us every day unseen and heard but always near still loved still missed and very dear i thought that was very very cute then she got me some vaseline she got me some some sweets and a hair bubble i love these hair bubbles they're really cool and a little yankee candle very cute and two masks one is a face mask and one is a hair and root mask so that would be really nice to put my hair 
And then, last but of course not least, this is by Philips Jones, Philip Jones Jewellery again. I definitely want to check them out because some of their jewellery is amazing. And these are some little cute sterling silver studs and a little heart. I'll show you that. And it says, true friends are never apart, made by distance but never in heart. Which is really, really cute because we've ended up with different school this schools this year. And obviously that is like, um, that means we can't see each other as often. So it kind of is a really nice reminder. And I'm sure whenever I wear those earrings, which won't be very long, um, I will be putting them on very soon um, then whenever I wear them I will think of her which is really nice um, another random present for my parents is I got this chocolate I got winter gingerbread edition so I'm going to try that I haven't ever tried that got some gingerbread chocolate they also got me a pack of crunchies my faves a huge bar of dairy milk my other fave and some shortbread because I've been craving shortbread recently and then oh don't know where to go next got so much stuff and then they also got me this really cute mug that's a like mug cake it's a three minute chocolate mug cake mug cake and it's got m&ms and like chocolate mixture and on the cup it says the answer is always chocolate which i definitely agree with look at that very cute very very cute very cute idea i thought that was a great idea very very cute i also staying on the the food front I got a happy birthday chocolate bar from my boyfriend Will, um, very very cute, I love how it says happy birthday on it. Then from my boyfriend Will's grandparents, I got this really cute scarf, it says it's from Accessorize and honestly it's so cute, it's really soft and really big which will be so great for the winter. Ooh. And basically it is like, my hair's going everywhere. It's like a checkered scarf and it's got pink, grey and like a cream colour going all through it and it is so, so pretty. It will go with absolutely everything and it's definitely my style. I don't honestly know how she knows me so well, honestly. So, so cute. So I want to say a big thank you to her because that is so cute. From my two older half-sisters, I got an ASOS gift card. They gave me £30, which is so, so nice. I cannot wait to spend this because as you've seen I've done a couple of ASOS trial hauls on this channel now and I just love ASOS so I can't wait to buy something with this because it just makes it really special knowing that you've got a gift that you can then buy and then wear it for ages. Then from my sister Holly who is in my sister tag video if you haven't ever seen her, she got me something from Pandora. I opened it expecting to actually have a gift from Pandora, but she couldn't decide what to get me, so she got me a Pandora gift card. This has, I think, £30? I think she said £30 or £40. I can't remember which, but it was £30 or £40 for definite, so very grateful for that because I can't wait to get some more jewellery from Pandora. I love Pandora rings. They're my favourite for definite. So from Will's parents, I got a gift card for all of these places, ASOS, Spotify, Now TV, Wag Mama's Odeon, can't speak, JD and WH Smith, which is really cool. And I think they said there was, I think there was 40 pounds on here, which I feel so, so lucky because that is so much money. So I got that and then they also got me a milk tray because I love a milk tray. I absolutely love dairy milk chocolate, as you can probably tell from this uh, birthday video, but yeah. I love the packaging, I think they've redesigned it, but most of my favourites are in there, so absolutely love that, um, so great for that. And then, gosh there's so much, I'm so sorry, I'm all over the place, more gifts from my parents. So my parents got me this thing I asked for which is called a light panel, it was off Amazon, and it basically is like a clear sheet of plastic, you can see that, and it has a light at the side. And it lights up like this, so you can put it on like a book and read it at night. Um, so I asked for this book, which if you know anything about young adult authors, you'll know that Jennifer Neven is a really, really good one. She wrote All the Bright Places and also Holding Up the Universe, which I have read both of them. And she's now released this one this year, which is called Breathless, and I cannot wait to read it. It looks so, so good. So yeah, so basically you get your book, and you get this, and you just put it on, and obviously when it's dark, it will light up. I thought that was really, really cool. A uh, really cool book. And then I got another book for my parents, which is Zoella. Zoe Sug. 
and Amy, I don't know how to pronounce her surname, McCulk, McCulk, McCulch, McCulch, something like that. Their new book, The Magpie Society, I've wanted this for ages and my mum managed to, my mum pre-ordered it back when it was first released so I managed to get a signed copy saying Zoe and Amy. Very, very cute and I cannot wait to read it because it sounds just like my book. It's been described as like a mixture of like a thriller, um, a thriller, a, a crime novel, like all of these perfect mixes for me. Um, absolutely love it. Uh, cannot wait to read it. So hopefully I'll get some time soon over the next month to read it. Another cool gift for my parents was this like charging stand. So it's a multi-function charging stand and it looks like this. I haven't tried it out yet but I actually cannot wait to. So there's loads of different ways you can charge it. So you plug it in with this obviously and then you have a little bit here for your AirPods, a thing here for your Apple Watch to charge and a thing here for your phone to charge and that's got loads of different ones on. The lighting is so bad but it's got it's got all of the different things so you can twizzle it and have all the different chargers, so USB-C um, and also the lightning adapter and that one which I can't remember that one's called. This is by this company here. I assume she just got it off of Amazon, not really sure, but yeah, I've been I've been really wanting one of those, I think they're really, really cool. And hopefully it'll be perfect to charge everything on. And it also has like a wireless bit in the middle, so if you've just got either AirPods or a phone that's wireless, then they can just sit on there. This lighting is so annoying. <laughs> I'm gonna sit back a little bit so that I've got nicer lighting. Okie dokes. So from my, I got some money from my aunties and uncles and grandparents, which was really, really nice. Um, I Money is perfect because it means I'm able to put some of my savings and stuff and also um, buy some nice things, which is really, really nice. I was very, very lucky to receive quite a bit of money this birthday. And then a couple more presents. I got this cookbook from my boyfriend Will because we both absolutely love going to Wagmama's and he even put a really cute little note in on the page which is chicken ramen which as I'm really basic is what I have every single time I go to Nando's and is a little note that says thought you might need this page Will which is really really cute and then he also got me this really really cute bangle so it's still a bangle and it says Will and Katie 25th of the 10th 17 because that is when we got together. I'll just take it off my wrist and show you it up close. I don't know if you can see that. I'm really hoping you can see that but yeah it's like engraved and I've always wanted a silver bangle. Yeah I've always wanted a silver bangle. I absolutely love it. Um, I just think bangles look so nice on the wrist and they're like kind of more sentimental because they're not just like a bracelet but looks so so cute. The last couple of things I got was my grandma gave me some money for driving lessons which is really nice of her. Um, my nanny also gave me some money and obviously my aunties and uncles but it's kind of a special birthday for me for my grandma because she saved up, me, her and her, her and my grandpa saved up money ever since that I was really really little for my driving lessons so they obviously give that to me on my 17th birthday and it's really really nice of them because it's, it's a really nice thing to do and it means that I don't have to worry about affording my own driving lessons so I'm really really grateful for that. And then I'm going to show you my last gift. Just move this camera around, try and get better lighting but I think it's really working. So the next gift and the final gift, or the final two gifts I should say, is this little key ring here. I've got it upside down, great. This little key ring here that says Katie. It's like a little leather key ring and it's engraved in my name. And then I got a car. <laughs> I got a car. <laughs> so basically my parents surprised me. I was on my way home from school and well I came home from school and my dad has just got a new car that looks kind of the same from the front. It's by the same company and he got one and it's white as well because my car's white and it looks exactly the same from the front and I was like mum dad's parked in your space in the driveway and she's like has he? That's so strange. And then as he pulled up, I realised it was my car. And I know mum had ordered me a car because she said it wasn't coming for another week. So they surprised me with that. And they'd gone and got it yesterday and they'd hidden it away from our house for the whole night. 
and they bought it here today so I have a car. So I might go out driving in a bit which is so exciting as I have my provisional licence and yeah, I just really excites me because I have a car. Ah. But my dad filmed my whole reaction of me getting a car so if I can include any of that footage, not sure, um, if I can then I will insert it here but if I can't then I'm really really sorry. Happy birthday, Di. Thank you. Oh, my God. Oh. <laughs> it says Katie. That's so cute. Oh, God, i got to lock it. Oh, my. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> but, yeah, I just want to say I've had an absolutely great birthday. Um, I wish I could have gone to the school for the whole day to be able to see everyone, but... Obviously I'm grateful for everyone who I got to see because we're in a lockdown and so and I've done I've had my mum made me a cake and I've opened so many presents and I just feel so so grateful to have so many people in my life that care about me and love me and everything like that and oh so pretty um and I just feel so grateful like my mum's got me flowers she got me um some roses that are sat over there and I just feel so, so grateful. Um, so yeah, really happy. Anyways, thank you so much for watching my 17th birthday haul. Hopefully I will see you next year. Um, but if you enjoyed, please make sure to give this a like and subscribe to my channel down below. And I will see you again very soon for another video. Bye.